Oh, Mike, Eric Reed, the winning trainer, Rick Dawson, the winning owner here, and Eric's dad, Herbie, what a proud moment for him. Eric thrust into the big time against all odds. You only got into the race earlier in the week. Just try, just try and put this into words. I don't know how I fell down the paddock when he hit the wire. I, I about passed out. I'm so happy. And explain that. This is something that, you know, is the reason everybody does this, because we're not supposed to be here. But I knew this horse loved the track, and he'd been training so good all year. And thanks to Rick for getting me here. But And Sonny Leon, they know who he is now. They do, the winning rider, Sonny Leon. Herbie, your son is a Kentucky Derby winning trainer. How does that feel for you? Unbelievable. <laughs> I can't, I can't explain it. It's unreal. And when you when you drew into this race, Rick, at the last moment, did you think we're just here for a great day, or did you genuinely believe that you could you could do something? Oh, never, ever, ever would Eric and I put a horse in a race we didn't think we could win. I promise you. We talked about this a year and a half ago. We talked about never putting a horse in that wasn't ready, wasn't fit. And we just knew that we had a shot because every time he went longer, he got better. And today we go to mile and a quarter, and he just kept going. Tell me about this man here, Eric, and the journey you've been on together. He's the reason I'm in this business right now. There's a lot of story back behind that, but I was ready to get out of the industry. I wasn't just disenchanted with the whole thing. You want to tell us that story? We've got the time. Well, I won't, but I met Eric through a close friend of mine I've known for 35 years. I met here in Kentucky. He introduced us, and I Pete thought, Chiro. you know what, Pete Chiro. And I said, you know what, I like this guy. I'm going to give him another shot. And it's been nothing but a great ride since. Oh, he always tells me exactly what's going on. Sometimes good news, sometimes the truth isn't good news, but it's always the truth, and I can deal with the truth. And this is the most unbelievable day ever, impossible.